Hi everyone, welcome to Evie's Toy House. Today we're making a brand new Miraculous Ladybug Season 2 Custom Equestria Girls Mini Doll. I'll be making Kagami Suruki from the repost episode. Have you seen it? Kagami is really good at fencing and it seems like Adrian likes her a lot too. I hope she is a recurring character because I'd like to find out if anything develops between her and Adrian. I've made a few other Season 2 dolls including Despair Bear and Prime Queen from Episodes 2 and 3. Have you seen them all? If not, their links are down below. To make Kagami, I'll be using DJ Pond 3 because I want to use her hair. And for the face, because I don't need these glasses, I'll replace them with Applejack's face. Before we start, if you like these customs, subscribe now and join the notification squad by clicking on the bell button. Okay, let's get started. The first thing we're going to do, of course, is to remove the hair. So we're going to move the hair from DJ Palm 3 onto Applejack. So we need to remove everyone's hair and swap. I've gone ahead and removed the hair from Applejack and we will now paint her face a flesh tone. For the eyes, we're going to draw it in using white. They're going to be narrow but not too small. Using thin black lines, we're going to outline the top and bottom of the eye. This is usually the hardest for me, but I think this time I did pretty good. Next, we'll draw in the eyebrows. For the irises, we're going to use brown. And then we're going to color in the pupils using black. Finally, we'll dot the eyes with white. Using a light pink color, we're going to draw in a smile. Now we're ready to add her bangs back in. I've attached DJ Palm 3's hair to the back and we're filling in the gap on the sides with air dry clay. Using a larger piece of clay, we will add additional hair to both sides. Now we need to fill in the space on top of her head. It needs to be flush with the hair on the sides of her face. For the front, we're taking a large flat piece of clay and place it over her face. Then we'll carefully cut a semicircle with an X-Acto knife to form the bangs. Be very careful during this. Make sure that you don't cut the paint underneath on the face. Alright, so it looks like we cut just enough to reveal her eyes. Once the clay is dry, we're going to paint it a dark blue color. I think it's really interesting that Adrian seems to like girls with dark blue hair. For the body, we're going to cover the original paint with a layer of white. Then we're going to paint in her red outfit. We're also going to paint her shoes red. Using white, we're going to add a few stripes to her pants and her shoes. Now 
Now we'll add two red stripes to her white gloves. On her shirt, we're going to take a darker red and draw lines to make it look like a quilt. Now to make our sword or foil, we're going to use oven bake clay. We're going to roll up a silver blade. For the guard, we're going to use red. So we'll take a red ball and flatten it down and curve it a little bit. Now using a small tube, we're going to cut a hole in the middle and place the blade through it. To add the piece that covers the knuckles, we'll use a tiny strip of clay. Alright everyone, so my Kagami doll is complete! What do you guys think? I think she looks super super cute. So here's an up close look at her face and her hair. So I really like the way her hair turned out. These bangs came down just right to where her eyes are. And she has these pretty cool brown eyes just looking at you actually kind of seriously. She has a cute pink smile and of course here on the back is her short crop hair which is also blue just like Marinette's. <laughs> Her outfit is uh, red and white, so you can see there's a little bit of a dark red um, lines across her chest for the quilt light material on her chest. And also she's wearing one glove that is holding her sword. So here's her sword, and here's the bottom side of her outfit, just these white socks on the bottom, and her red sneakers with the white stripes. So let me know down below in the comment section what you think of Kagami. Do you like her? Would you like to see her some more in future episodes? I really would. Alright, so if you guys have not yet subscribed, make sure to hit that subscribe button and give me a thumbs up. And I hope to see you guys next time. Bye!